Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, then welcome. So the way that I usually do this is I have a vlog uh, where you'll come with me in Kate's Value Village. We also get bubble tea and churches. It's a really good time. And then afterwards, I'll show you everything that I got. I styled eight different outfits for you guys um, based off of the pieces that I got. So I hope you're excited. I am super stoked. I got some really, really cute stuff. Hello! <laughs> Hello! Welcome to our fourth Fourth Value Village Thrift Hall. Hey! I really, really, really want to find jeans. Like, jeans are like the one thing mm -hmm. that I want to find today. And we're off! <laughs> Wanted to fill you guys in. That is not herpes. Um, that is a pimple that I messed with. So there you go. Please don't comment and ask if I have herpes because I do not. Of the mouth. I'm just kidding. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, Kate, do you think she's okay? <laughs> Where are your friends? Brittany! <laughs> you okay? We gotta take her home. Oh my god. Call her an Uber. <laughs> what is that? Is that drugs? <laughs> what are kids doing these days? Alrighty, so we are leaving Value Village. We just stopped at the Asian supermarket. We're having a little chip party. We have uh, two Calbee. We have hot and spicy. Those are me, because I'm hot and spicy. <laughs> <laughs> and I got seaweed, because you girl. But yeah, it was a very, very, very successful thrift haul. Very easy with her hand movement. Yeah, I am very happy with all the things that I got. Got a That's lot true. of stuff. Well, we also tried on like a million. Yeah, oh here. my god, there was such a long line, and we tried on a million different things. Yeah, um, oh, there's a churches right here. What? Where? What? What? Where are you? Where are you, churches? All right. Are you lying to me? It's definitely not here. <laughs> All right, so we're also gonna get bubble tea because we are in the right neighborhood for it. Um, <laughs> there's three on this block. Yeah, there's three. The guy told Kate that she probably wouldn't like it, so let's see. Yeah, it's good. Mostly coconut. Oh, solid. Yeah, I'll try it. Yeah, it does mostly take like coconut. It tastes like black said we all. They did not describe it even. Oh, really toasty peanuts. It's like sweet too, isn't it? Yeah, it's sweet. Yeah. But I like it. Good. <laughs> Hey, hey! Me and Kate have been trying to come here for such a long time. I feel like I'm on Food Network right now. <laughs> All right, guys. Come on, let's go. Come on. <laughs> this is actually my dream as a child. Uh -huh. I got one original, one spicy. The one spicy one's much bigger. Yeah, is it spicy? I think yeah. it is. Everyone always says, I don't know, is there churches in America? I don't, I don't know. think so. I haven't heard of it till here. So everyone says that churches is way better than KFC and better than Popeyes. So moment of truth. Original. Thanks, mom. <laughs> They're juicy. Oh, this is good. Juicy. This is really good. I'm trying to spice one. <laughs> it's actually spicy. Most times it's not actually spicy. Like my hot and spicy chips. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's really good. So the first outfit is actually what I'm wearing right now. I got this cute little cami and I know that these are super popular in middle school and I like went through a phase where I loved them and then absolutely hated them when I was in high school. So I got this and then I also got these super rad jeans. I'll just move up the step here. I posted these on my Instagram and everyone like flipped out. Kate actually found them um, but they weren't in her size so she was like, yo, do you want these? And I was like, uh, yeah, like they're so cool. I've never had jeans that fit this well. Um, 
and like I said like in the video jeans were the one thing I wanted to find and I got two pairs of jeans so yeah I absolutely love these the brand is bongo um but it does have kind of a vintagey feel so I feel like um it didn't come out anytime recently so for my second outfit this is actually the only thrifted piece and it's from Topshop it's this really beautiful like crepey material and I don't know I just really like the plunge V because it's a little bit it has a businessy kind of feel but it is very sexy as well and I actually wore it when I was working a I was working like a catering job one day just like kind of an odd job and I wore this with like a little lace bralette kind of situation under it and it looked really really good um, these pants that I paired them with are just from forever 21 um, they're just really basic black pants and then the shoes are actually from Zushu so for my next outfit I styled this top and this is the only thing in my outfit that I got from Value Village um, it was super inexpensive and it had straps that I didn't really like because it held it up really high and I just kind of wanted something that looked more like a tube top so I just cut the straps off and because it's so tight it stays up really well and it's so beautiful with these pants um, these I didn't thrift here I thrifted them in high school um, back in San Francisco I don't remember where they're from but they're these really beautiful like mosaic kind of like flowy pants they're so wide leg and I styled it with a bunch of different kinds of tops but this is the first one that like it really just looks so nice together it's like a really beautiful silhouette um I stand up so you can see but this is like probably my favorite outfit that i'm going to sell for you guys <laughs> so these are the other pair of jeans that i told you guys about they are incredible i'm actually gonna have to stand up for this um they are citizens of humanity and they're flared at the bottom i don't know if you can tell but they fit so well. It's like, it's actually incredible. And this shirt actually was a dress that it was just kind of shapeless. Um, I wore it as a dress a couple times, but I wasn't in love with it. And so I just cropped it and then I didn't have time to hem it. So I've actually just been wearing it with a bandeau and then tucking the bottom underneath. And then it just creates like this nice little cinch shape. So yeah, I really like the back of it too. Yeah, it's super cute. I love this outfit like I'm telling you guys like everything I got was so cute like I love everything that I got okay so in this next outfit everything is thrifted so this top I believe that they I think they were shape ups like they were either actually like for your waist and your butt or they were for your top I really am not sure but it was longer and I again just cropped it because I wanted it to be a crop top and like yeah the length was kind of weird it went to like about here but these pants actually they are kids pants and they had these little like patches on them that I just took off the patches looked like it looked very kid pants like it's like a large um, probably for boys I think but yeah so do not sleep on the kids section and then these boots look at how incredible these are they're so dope like I really wanted some that kind of looks like work boots but were really casual because I have some Doc Martens um, that are actually just like Chelsea boots but those just weren't as fashionable as I wanted them to be and so yeah I'm really excited about these I'm so excited to wear them during like the fall and winter so yeah, I really messed with this outfit um, and it was thrifted. It was awesome. So for this outfit, I thrifted this top and the brand is Diesel. I'm not super familiar with their brand, but I saw these patches and that's actually what caught my eye. It works really well with these jeans. Yeah, it's like super, super comfortable and casual. I would wear this to school, honestly. Um, I worn it just like being out and about, running errands. So it's a super dope outfit. And this shirt actually has two little ties in the front so you can tighten it, but I don't really like how it looks when it just hangs out. So I just tuck them in, but yeah, this is the shirt. And these elbow patches, like also the flare of the arm and they're short, it's just like such a strange shirt, but it's so cute. <laughs> so for my next outfit, I'm wearing the same top as earlier. This hat was not thrifted, but I thought it just looked really good with the outfit. And it's actually the skirt that I thrifted. So this, um, it was kind of long. It was like a mid-length skirt and it had like these slits, which I actually really liked. And I wish that it fit better, but because it was um, a little bit too big, then I had to Cut it because it would just like move around so much and it wouldn't stay at my waist so cutting it actually did help to keep it in place so yeah I just made it a little mini skirt so yeah I really like this outfit it has kind of like a 90s vibe I think like an early 2000s maybe 
Yeah. So this is my last outfit and actually both of these pieces were thrifted and fun fact I wore this on a first date. So this top um, it's really structured. It's a really nice thick material which I really liked. Um, at first it didn't catch my eye because I was like it's just a plain cream tank top. I don't really need one of those but it is just such a nice material and it was really well made. So I'm into that. It doesn't have a brand unfortunately. And these pants look at how amazing these are. Um, I don't know what this pattern is called, but it's that really kind of like bougie royal curtain feel like it does kind of look like a bedroom curtain, but I'm really into it and it's a nice like high-waisted fit. So yeah. That is all of the things that I thrifted and I styled for you guys. I really hope you enjoyed it. Please let me know what your favorite outfits were below. Honestly, it's so hard for me to choose. I'm really into like basically all of them. It was a really, really, really successful thrift haul for both me and Kate. So yeah, as always, I hope you have a lovely day. Um, you can follow me on my Instagram if you would like and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. We made it. I know you can't tell. Oh my God, look at the clouds. They look so pretty. It's you and me, best friend.